Alright, so it's been a little bit since I've last recorded. Where were we? Uh, well, we didn't heal when I was in the Pokemon Center. That's one thing. And now we've got Master on our team. Alright, well, let's go heal real quick. Yes, hi, I know I was just in here, but I, uh, I need to heal again. So we got Juju, Chael, and Tai Chi. They're the new people on our team other than Master. I know we lost Bitderm in the, uh... Did I go into here yet? I'm not going to do another contest, but I don't think I went into here, did I? Oh, it's the old man! What's that? Is this machine next to me you're interested in? There's the Berry Blender. Hell yeah. I love making po- He was in the original game. In the old days, it used to take four of us to make Poke Blocks with this machine. Are you twins? That performance by Lee Sai and Ali just now was amazing. Hey, you were really impressed too, right? That's what I call a spectacular talent. Pokemon showed off their talents until the excitement in the hall is at its peak. Then their allure can't be held back when it comes to bursting out as a spectacular talent. That's really amazing. Lovely. I'll give it a try next time too. Hello? 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 No, hello? Uh, hello? Hmm. I was keeping my excitement to myself until yesterday, but my Pokemon and I quite w weren't quite good enough today. Perhaps the eyes of the judges become more discerning at higher ranks. No one's up here. Oh, there's an old man. Hello. The contest spectacular is held over four different contest halls all over Hoenn. That makes me question why they would have a contest hall in this place, which is just nothing but arid farmland. You can join the Contest Spectacular at any of them. I always go to Lily Cove, but today, I feel like a change of pace. Ehehehe. <laughs> My friends and I did our best in the contest, and now for some reason I feel like I have a lot more fans. Alright, kid. Whatever you say. Right, so... Hello. See, take a look at this. My precious Meryl. It's slick and smooth as a plushie. If you have a Meryl too, you can... Pet it silk and smooth as plush. Alright. You're weird. Pop a sick wheelie. So I don't think I caught any Pokemon here on Route 114. I also don't think I went into here, did I? Hello. When you're in a cave and you have a Pokemon that you dig, you'll be back at the entrance in no time. Um, hello? I'm the Fossil Maniac. I'm a nice guy who loves fossils. Do you want a fossil? But the fossils around here are belong to me. None for you. If you can't go without a fossil, try the desert on Route 111. Okay. Alright. So I can't find any, like, secret fossils in here, right? No? No? Okay. Oh, I can't even pop... I can't even... It's a, inside a cave! Why can't I not use a bike inside a cave? Come on. So, man, it would suck to live with that guy just digging holes in the wall. I think I spoke to you, yep. I'm just trying to get my bearings of where I was last time. Like I said, I, don't, I know we lost bit derms to this dude right here. This time I'll do it. I always think that so I can't walk away from fishing or Pokemon. Alright, but we got... Ooh. Oh, Swablu's! We can catch two more Pokemon in this route because we haven't caught anything. And uh, I don't think there's anything else other than this grass, so... Let's see what our first Pokemon is. A Vanillite! Hmm. Hmm. That's, uh... Interesting. I don't... Um... I don't know what move to use. Maybe I just throw a Pokeball and hope? The problem is Bitterm was always, you know, the Pokemon I used to catch because it just had Quick Attack and it was nice and easy, you know, a low bit of damage. All right, never mind then. Vanilla is ours. That was nice and easy. Vanilla, the question mark Pokemon. I've met two of them apparently. Interesting. Look at that dumb face. <laughs> Stupid face. 
It doesn't actually have any attack. Is that its attacking animation? Is that its other animation? It just kind of bobs side to side. Alright, Vanillite, you will be nicknamed Kappa! That's uh There we are. Wait! Why can I not enter that word? Uh Um Cap? No. Oh, is it is it because of PP? Pee -pee? Is it seriously PP that's stopping me from entering the word Kappa? Um. Alright, well, what if I remove one of the P's? Kappa. Alright, apparently Kappa's fine, not Kappa. That's so weird that it blocked me from putting PP. You're not a trainer, are you? I'm Gavin Br Okay, yeah, I spoke to you, I know. Oh, okay, thank you. There's grass up here. I don't think any of these grass. Ooh, there's berries over there. Let's go walk our work our way over towards the berries. Based on, ooh, I hear a Pokemon too. Who are you? Let's see. Um, well, you're not up here. Oh, here you are. Who are you? You are a Carablast. No, I don't want a Carablast. I know Carab. Please don't be a Carablast now. God damn it! I was gonna say, I know Carablast can only evolve if you also have a Shelmet in your team. Which is why I didn't want a Carablast, because the chance of me getting a Shelmet on the team as well, pretty goddamn low. Also, I've got. This will be the second Pokemon on this route that won't help against the gym. And when we got it, that's fine. I'm, I'm glad we got it. Carablast, the question mark Pokemon. I've also met two of those. Do you have a better attacking animation? Yeah, you do. What about your second one? No? Okay. Right, so Carablast, this is going to be a very hard to name spell based on the map or the list here. It's renamed. M I J Midge Kami Midge Kami Midge Kami Okay So now maybe maybe I do waste a uh, gym catch on purposely getting your shelmets I mean oh that's a swablu isn't it I hear Well it's not up here so I can't go to look Just get these berries But yeah, of course, knowing my luck. I mean, when I play Blaze Black, the same thing happens on the the little um, the little forests. I can't remember what the forest is called now, but there's a forest where you can get Shelmets and um, and Carablasts, and I always whoa, what are you? You see that weird? What is that? Oh, it's a Mistrevus. Oh, I would have loved to have a Mistrevus. That's close that. Yeah, I always end up getting a... Uh, yeah, that's fine. I know we got a dual battle here. I always end up getting one of the two. Who taught you to battle like that? What? I haven't... We haven't battled yet. Excuse you? Alright, so they've got grass and water, and I've got... A rock type Pokemon that's going to get messed up. So you're going to have to come out pretty fast. What we're going to do is we're going to hit a Sludge Bomb on Rosalia. And Chael is going to have to come out for Edkin probably. I can't send out Wi-Fi because Rosalia might attack. So hopefully Chael can take whatever hit. She's, he's probably going to get both hits. Nope. Okay, they went for Juju. Oh no! Psychic moves. Leave Juju alone. Oh god. Oh god. Um. All right, we got to heal Juju. Um. 
We're gonna have to use a... No, we're gonna have to use a lem... Ooh, I'm gonna have to use a lemonade. And Juju, because Juju can take another extra sensory. As long as it doesn't crit. And... Edkin is just gonna have to slash the Roselia. We need to get rid of the Roselia pretty fast. I think it was Roselia that had the extra sensory. Hopefully it's not the Azumarill. Okay. Why did it say that Juju got a boost of XP? Usually that happens if it's a traded Pokemon, right? But it's definitely not a traded Pokemon because I caught it myself. Oh, almost. Oh, because it's part fairy type. That's right. Okay. Well, uh, just kill it this turn, please. I completely forgot that Azumarill became water fairy. Good job, Juju. Well done. Poison jab. Um. Will that definitely poison somebody? 80 power physical. What's sludge bomb? 90 power. Um. How about we get rid of uh, mud bomb? We don't need mud bomb. That's pretty sick, he's learning some really nice poison moves, actually. See, Chael got a boosted. Why does Chael get a boosted XP? What an amazing way of battling. What an amazing way of battling. You were just slacking off my battling style. <gasps> Chael's evolving! Man, look how cool Chael looks now. I don't actually remember how to evolve Graveler into Golem. So... That's not going to help that much. Um, I mean, Master isn't going to learn... He's gonna, not going to gain any XP, because I can't really afford to switch him out. So he's probably going to just stay really low rank. I don't feel like... Um, Switching in and out, really? At least not right now. We're gonna have one more battle. Actually, I don't think I can sneak past him, can I? No, I didn't think so. Oof, 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 oof. Want to battle against my Pokemon? Uh, no. Alright, never mind then. <laughs> His face. Ooh, a Porygon! Um... Well, Juju has to come out pretty fast. Because it's probably going to have Psychic-type moves. Um... Maybe we will go with Shale, I think? I think that might be the wrong choice, but we're going to try it anyway. Okay, so now he's levitating, but that's, that's fine. I'm going to hit a Stealth Rock. I don't think I've ever used Stealth Rock in Pokemon before. Signal Beam, that's a bug move. Ooh, that had quite a bit of damage. Jeez. All right, well, let's... Um, uh, the problem is Rock moves are always really weak. Let's go for... wait. Um, let's go for Rock Blast. If you get five, you're going to kill it. Oh, that was a crit. Good job. Only two? Ah. Oh. 
Come on, you gotta take a single beam. Good job. Alright, we know you're fast, so let's go for another Rock Blast. Good job. Well done. Well done, Chill. I've learned not to uh, panic too much. Usually I would be like, Oh no, do I, do I switch him out or do I not? I mean, if he misses, if he blah 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 blah. I mean, there's a good chance he could miss. It's only a 90 accuracy move. Um, let's go with Tai Chi, I think. Yeah, usually I would panic there, but I just thought, you know what, let's not panic, let's just do the sensible, well, the sensible thing would be to heal, chail, or switch him out. But, you know, I knew I was faster. Also, okay, that didn't do a lot of damage, Stealth Rock, wow. Can you do, um, double Stealth Rocks, like you can with, uh, Toxic Spikes? I don't know, like I said, I've never, ooh, Thunderfang, that's not good, chail. I mean, Tai Chi, okay. I gave you the leftovers, which is good, good, good. Let's hope this thing doesn't have pursuit, because you're coming out for Edkin here. Don't have pursuit, don't have pursuit, don't have... <gasps> oh, thank God. I'm always scared about Pokemon with pursuit now. It's just, I can't help it. It's a good job you just bit a bear. You know what happens when you bite a bear? You get slashed in the face. That poor dino. <laughs> it just took two slashes in its life. Lickitung. Okay. Um, we're going to take out... Mm, we, let's give Juju a chance. Let's give him a chance. I think Juju deserves a... Uh, he deserves to do something in this battle. He started out. So let's go ahead and we will hit it with the new poison jab we got. Ooh, that was really good. That's a psychic move, isn't it? Yes, it is. Okay. Um, that's a 90 power. That's an 80 power. And that's a 65. So we're going to go with Sludge Bomb because Sludge Bomb probably will finish it off. No, it won't. It does less damage. Ooh, Juju. Alright, never mind. Let's finish it off with a poison jab. Well done, Juju. Well done. Oh my god, he's got one more! Uh, okay, well I guess Wi Fly is gonna have to come out. This thing is probably, probably gonna have Thunderfang. Just like uh, Dino did. It's gonna be oh, it's gonna be quite effective against Wi Fly, isn't it? Fuck! Why did I do that? 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 I can't afford to switch anyone in. And I don't. Oh, I mean, I've got Icy Wind, which would be super effective, but that's only fifty-five. Um, I think what I do is I don't attack. What I do is I heal Edkin. Because Edkin is probably the only Pokemon that will stand a chance against this thing. And if it uses Thunderfang, Wi-Fly is probably dead. Yep, that's Thunderfang. Oh, Wi-Fly! Oh... I, I'm an idiot. I should have sent out Edkin and healed him on his first turn. Why fly I predicted to carry us through the fourth gym? Oh. Stupid dragon. A stupid Miki for getting completely... I knew... I knew uh, Drudagon was a dragon type. I already saw that his dragon had Thunderfang before. I just... <sighs> my, my Pokemon. Yeah, what about my Pokemon? You killed one.
A big body, it's all lumpy and hard, enormous horns and vicious fangs. I wish I had a Pokemon like that. You do, you idiots. It killed my Pokemon. Oh, we now have to go bury Wi-Fi. God damn it! Wi-Fi. <sighs> Wi-Fi was such a good team member. I mean, she hadn't been on the team long, only after the the third gym. But look at her move set! Bubble Beam, Icy Wind, Air Slash and Roost. She was geared to destroy the fourth gym. She really, really was. And I just made a massive cock up really. I... We saw the Dino had Thunder Fang. And for some reason it didn't click in my mind that his second dragon would also have Thunder Fang. All I saw was the health of all my Pokemon, and I saw that Y Fly and Master were both on full health. Obviously, I couldn't send Master out, so then I decided, okay, we'll just send Y Fly out. And as soon as I clicked it, I it hit me like a ton of bricks that, oh, Y Fly is now going to die if it has an electric move. If it had an electric move, it was going to die because it would be four times effective because electric is super effective against water and flying. There was no, no chance of Y-Fly surviving. But then it was too late. I mean, I could have switched out Edkin. Edkin would have just died from the Thunderfang. I don't remember how much health he was on, but one you can see there one Thunderfang took him down to 71, so that was um, 30, 36 damage. I've got no idea how much health he was on, but you can't kind of look back and be like, oh, well, he was on 40-something health, so I could have switched him out and he would have taken the hit. No, because I didn't know how much damage Thunderfang was going to do. It could have done more than 30 damage. It could have done 50 damage, for all I knew. You can't... You can't use future knowledge to affect a past choice. Like, Edkin probably could have survived if he had switched in, but at the time, I didn't know that, and I would have been risking Edkin for Wi-Fi, you know? And if Edkin came out and died, then who would be left to to defeat the drug digger, drug, 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 The dragon. It was... <laughs> it was the wrong move to send you out, and I'm sorry, Wi-Fi. I, you, I'm pretty sure you were close to evolving, which makes it even more heartbreaking. But... I'm sorry, I made, I made a wrong choice. It, it was just a slip up, and you had to pay the price. And I'm sorry buddy, I'm sorry that you won't be able to carry the fourth gym for us, like I predicted. <sighs> Alright. Zoe is going to be no use because it's, she's a bug type. Vanillite is definitely going to be no use because it's an ice type. Mijikami, not going to be any use because it's a bug type. Um, Klefki, steel type, definitely not going to be any use. Um, see, Starlight and Goo are not going to be any use either. Pikachu, I don't trust. So really, it's between Munchlax and Dunsparce of who goes on to the team next. Um, I think Dunsparce. I, I, hmm, no, 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 <gasps> no, you know who comes on to the team next? You know who comes onto the team next? We're gonna go all the way back down to the daycare! No, go away, Bishop. 
We're going all the way back down to the daycare and we're picking up Dark Judge. The other Pokemon that I predicted would carry us through the fourth gym. It's finally Dark Judge's moment to shine. Move. Thank you. Stupid things. It might be, uh... It might be stupid picking up Dark Judge. You know, we still got quite a ways to go before we, uh... Before we face the gym. Also, have I not encountered a Pokemon? There's two routes I've now cycled through. And I haven't encountered a single Pokemon. That's kind of amazing, honestly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, use Rock Smash already. Hey, an Aoife. Nice. I wonder if you could farm Aoifas. You just go back and forth along this route. And then Rock Smash. Go back into Mobile. Go back up Rock Smash. be pretty boring to do it for like an hour straight, but you know. Going all the way back to the daycare here. Hello. I want to take back... Yes, I am here to take one back. I'm going to take back Dark Judge. 12 levels! Good job, Dark Judge! No, I don't want to take Mikichu back. Actually, let's stick another Pokemon in the daycare while we take Dark Judge back. Who do we stick in, though? Um... Level 27 now, Storm Drain, Aurora Beam, Silver Wind, Gust, and Sweet Kiss. Alright, that's not the best move set, Dark Judge. i uh, tell you what, let's actually just move you out real quick. Who do we put in the daycare? Um, uh, maybe Carablast? Yeah, let's just stick Carablast in. Why not? Whoops. Uh, no, no, no. Sorry, sorry, Meowth. Let's just, uh... There we are. Yes, hello. I would like you to, uh, take a Pokemon, please. I want you to come and take, uh, Mijikami. No, 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 no. I accidentally pressed A. No thanks, no thanks, no thanks. There we go. Alright, um... So let's take Dark Judge back here. There we go. Perfect. It really sucks losing, um... Oh, look! Look on the bottom screen! Oh, why flies there? This is the route we caught why fly on! Every Pokemon we caught on this route has died. I'm just going to switch these around just so I can, uh... Ah, yeah, that's fine, why not? But look at the bottom screen. We had Lord Nyan, who died. Pretty perfectly. Wi-Fi, who just died. And, uh, Bonsley. Oh, God, who was Bonsley again? Uh, Trouble Sketch. Trouble Sketch died in the Morvile Gym. Oh, damn. That's really sad. I'm pretty sure if I go back, like, I know that probably Pinwheel Forest, is it Pinwheel? No, not Pinwheel Forest, that's Gen 5. Um, Petalburg Forest. That is the place where all, all this Pokemon can be traced back to? Wait, no, outside, outside the forest, so Route 3? No. Route 104? One, two, yeah, Route 104 is the place where our oldest Pokemon are from. And that is Goo and Starlight. Because we caught them just outside Petalburg Forest. In Petalburg Forest, we caught Mikichu and Pixiepuff, and Pixiepuff died. Mikichu is still alive, living in the daycare. So, I mean, it's kind of sad to think that the... We lost our starter, we lost the Pokemon on Route 101, we lost the Pokemon on Route 102. 
We lost the Pokemon on Route 103. Route 104 is now, you know, where our oldest Pokemon are from. That's really sad to think about. Also, again, I... D whoa, what were you? Hang on, what were you? I don't recognize that. Oh, it's a Sandshrew. Okay, I don't give a shit about Sandshrew. Close that. There we go. No, another Bishop. I don't need a Bishop. Do I have anything that I can uh, make out of soot now? Hello. Oh, Ash, rather. No, okay, never mind. 67, you can make it. Okay. Well, I'm not gonna. I don't care about having a blue flute, really. Also, I think, didn't they change it so you could only get ash from the big, um, big piles of it? I'm fairly certain they did that, because in the original it was just from any grass you could get ash. Let's go get this item. Ooh, wait, there's a special Pokemon on the bottom screen. Ooh, a star piece too, that's cool. What? What? A, it's another Mistrevious, but what? What is it? Level thirty-five! Wow. That's kind of um. Kind of weird. We get level thirty-five Mistrevious pop up on there. It's not like I've been chaining them or anything. Okay. Yeah. Oh God. You guys are. Where are you taking the professor? Hey, stop right there! Okay. Whatever you whatever you say, Brendan. Um, I don't think I can sneak past these kids. Oh yes, I can. Hell yeah! So I love what they did to this route on the remake, adding in these uh, meteor holes. Oh heck, there's a rare bone there. Oh, I should stick on the the special hat, shouldn't I? Whoops, no, not that. There we go. Anything in here? Comet Shard. Cool. Yeah, it's really cool what they did to um, the route just here outside uh, Meteor Falls. It's Meteor Falls, isn't it? I called it Draco Falls, which it isn't. It just makes me think of dragons, honestly, because of um, this is the only place you can get a bag on. So I just associate this place with dragons. Uh, ooh, okay, I slipped past him without meaning to. Anything in here? Um, no, it doesn't seem like there's anything around here. Nothing even in that rock, that's weird. I definitely can't sneak past you, can I? Oh, I can, hell yeah! Yeah, Meteor Falls? Yep. Meteor Falls, Rustboro City through here. 